just levitate Hey guys, check it out! We got some new Bring Arts and they're from the Final Fantasy 7 game, of course. As you can see here, we got Tifa Lockhart looking great. 5.3 inches tall. She's looking awesome, honestly. Remember, this is based off the original game. I'm pretty sure it's a combination of the artwork of the game and the actual cutscene. So, um,. This is looking pretty darn awesome. I mean, the hair separation is a lot. The red eyes, of course, that chest, they nailed it. And check out her arms with the gloves looking great. Even her shoes look awesome, man. She looks awesome. Here's what she looks like from the back. Looking nice. That guard, like I said, a really good attention to detail right there. And she just looks cute. She looks cute. Highly articulate as well. Check it out here. She's getting ready to fight. The kick. And of course, she's done. Man, this, this is just gonna be awesome. I love how they detail the bandages there. And like I said, that elbow pad looks awesome. Looks awesome right there. She even has her little suspenders as well attached to her shirt, which is really awesome. But yeah, the figure is. This is everything you're gonna get. You're just gonna get the figure with one expression, one head I mean, and the three different hands here. And of course you have the hands that you want already attached in the feed. And that's pretty much it for Tifa and I have to say, I'm gonna pick her up. Hey, I like I said it. I wouldn't go back to Bring Arts unless they made the Final Fantasy VII squad, and they did. We'll see how good they are. Hopefully, they don't disappoint. Let's keep going. Okay, guys, we got Aerith here, also from Bring Arts. She is 5.4 inches tall, so. A little bit taller than Tifa and that's because of the hair obviously. Um, she's looking beautiful, she's looking great, the hair looks good, the expression on her face, the eyes look amazing, her little jacket with the dress, the boots, looking beautiful. Now here you can see her from the back, again that hair separation is pretty darn awesome, the tail here with the hair looks great, it looks pretty natural, you know, from all the plastic, um, the little detailing of the jacket with a little bit of the freaking silver color, her bangle, the dress all around the back of the boots, she comes with her staff which is awesome, I love that and it looks great. But you can see that she does have some good articulation but the dress is gonna hinder her shoe. so she's gonna be more of a standing figure. Check it out, you can have her praying, she actually comes with the praying hands and she comes with the closed eyes head. So she does come with a little bit more accessories than Tifa does. And here you can see all the accessories, you're gonna get of course. Uh, the close eyes head, you're gonna get her stuff as you can see here, you're pretty much gonna be able to split it apart and then connect it, and then you get the different hands. And that's pretty much it, I mean, like I said, I'm pretty excited about these two, they came out of nowhere, um, but I, I'm gonna give it a try, I'm gonna give it a chance and see what they have done, maybe they have fixed a lot of quality control issues, hopefully they did. So we'll guess we'll find out first with Tifa and that's gonna be awesome. So I'm guessing Tifa, um, Aerith and then maybe that down the line. We know we're getting Cloud in November. So I'm guessing they're planning on releasing the whole team including Sephiroth before November. That's what I'm thinking. If they're planning on doing that, that's gonna be uh, very interesting. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like. Comment, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys next time.